Well, howdy, friends and neighbors. How y'all doing? Shoot, it's a mighty fine day to be out here in the backwoods of Missouri. Hey, I uh, wanted to do a quick little video, a little bit about the uh, equipment that I'm using. I've got a couple of cool new uh, tools that I'm uh, going to put into place this, uh, this here season. Um, the mount for the uh, cell phone. Um, I've had that on the front of the boat there for, uh, I think, all of last year. Um, one of the best mounts I've ever had. Um, unbelievably strong, uh, made of aluminum, not plastic. It just holds up, doesn't move. I never have to worry about this thing, so we're going to get into that a little bit. We're going to talk about the uh, the new case that I've got for the GoPro. Um, it fits the uh, the Hero 5, 6, and 7, so it's a uh, kind of a nice little case for those that uh, have any of those cameras. And what it's really meant for is it holds a little dongle that uh, GoPro makes you use to plug a microphone into, well, the GoPro. Um, as we all know, GoPros have never been uh, known for spectacular audio, so uh, using a uh, lavalier mic like I've got here, or maybe a shotgun mic uh, that I've got in the truck, definitely uh, improves the audio for those of you that uh, are filming and shooting with GoPros. Um, definitely a must have in my opinion, um, but uh, GoPro never really put anything in to uh, improve that audio. Um, they did a little bit better on the seven. Um, I've heard they've done better on the eight, but I'm just not impressed with, uh, with that camera yet. So uh, we're gonna stick with the, uh, the Hero 7s um, for now and yeah. But hey, this is about that case. Um, uh, when we want to talk about uh, Ulanzi, uh, Ulanzi's uh, the company that puts that out. Um, boom, there she is right there. Um, it's a uh, pretty nice case, I gotta say. It's, uh, it's strong, it's durable. Um, I'm gonna take it apart here and we're gonna check it out. But hey, before we get to that, make sure, hey, if you haven't hit that subscribe button, hit that there for me. All right, that helps things out. Hit that like button for this video if you like the video. Um, you know, hey, appreciate you. Go ahead and get yourself some of that Backwoods merch. We've got the uh, dad cap in both white and black. All right, we've got the trucker cap if you like that mesh back. All right, we've got that one for you here in black as well. So hook yourself up with some Backwoods merch. I appreciate that, support the channel. Um, this video is being brought to you by me. Um, nobody paid me for this. I'm not being sponsored by uh, Yolanzi. I hope I'm saying that right. But uh, we're going to go ahead and tear it apart. Um, and uh, I'll show you what comes in the box. I'll show you how the camera fits in. I'll show you how the new dongle fits in. And um, hey, it's a great way not to uh, have to dangle your dongle. That's all I got to say about that. So, hey, let's go ahead and back this up a little bit. Let's uh, open this box up and I'll show you what's all in the box and how it all fits together. Let's get that done. All right, friends and neighbors. Well, hey, here we are. We got everything kind of uh, laid out here. What we're going to talk about today. We've got the uh, Hero 7 Black. We've got the, uh, the must-have dongle that uh, you have to purchase separately from the camera to be able to plug this in so that it gives you the ability to not only charge your uh, camera but also uh, pull data from it. It gives you the port for your microphone which is the whole reason for the, the dongle. So um, with that piece there plugged into your camera, all right, well there it is. It just kind of dangles there and well that's no good like i said you don't want to you know dangle your dongle all right so what they uh failed to do with gopro is come up with the appropriate case that would you know mount this and i've seen people like velcro them to the bottom of it but as we all know this camera comes you know in this little harness case that it you know and it's it, it's a decent case um they solved this problem with the hero uh with the eight um uh, it has these feet mounted right to the bottom of the camera, but unfortunately um, that took away from the door on the bottom, leaving your battery and your memory card exposed while you were using uh, that port. So not a very good design feature uh, as far as I was, I was concerned. So I, you know, chose not to upgrade to the Hero 8 because, well, um, it's pretty much useless uh, for things like vlogging and, you know, anything but, you know, taking it underwater. Um, which I guess if that's what you're doing with your camera, you need to keep it all sealed up and uh, waterproof, hey, there you go. But you're not using an external mic when you're doing it. So, you know, for all other things that we use our GoPros for, um, yeah, not exactly the best call there down there at GoPro. But, hey, the Hero 7 Black is an amazing camera. The stabilization is awesome. All you got to do is put it in the right case, all right? So, we've taken this case off, all right? 
just going to set that aside. And that's when these guys come in, all right? Uh, Ulanzi, um, awesome company. I've been using their uh, this little brushed aluminum uh, spring-loaded mount for my... Uh, for my uh, cell phone up on the front of the boat um, and this just made the perfect little bow mount uh, camera mount for uh, for those purposes um, I added this little uh, um, is it a hot shoe cold shoe this little thing um, which <laughs> which is real nice and you're gonna see here in just a second how that ties in with this here case so let's go ahead and uh, open it up let's set the camera and this little guy here aside, you see right there, all right, that's uh, if you need one of these, if you need a really indestructible um, mount for your cell phone, doesn't really matter, it, uh, you know, screws down and tightens in real nice, got nice rubber feet, locks it in place, will not fall out, and this thing is indestructible, absolutely must have, so get yourself one of these, um, if you don't already have one, you're going to love me for that, all right, and here we got the case for the GoPro 7. Actually, it's uh, it'll fit the uh, the GoPro, the Hero, uh, the five, the six, and the seven. So, um, well, there she is. All right, so go ahead and get rid of that baggie there, and just a strong little case. It is made out of a a plastic material, but um, very rugged, very solid. Um, I uh, I don't know if I'd want to see it in aluminum. Maybe I would, but uh, here's how she works. All right, you got a little tab right here pushes down and your back door slides out real nice okay um, the camera um, very nicely made I, they, they really got this right it slides right in the back slides right in locks into place absolutely no rattling around your camera is securely mounted within there and now what you've got is you've got the uh, the shoe holder up here so that I can take and mount this in and fix that to the top or if you're using a shotgun mic or something of that nature uh, maybe an external uh, light um, that'll uh, make that a lot easier to mount on the top of your camera um, if you're using this as the viewfinder uh, makes it real nice when you've got that out there and the phone on it it uh, yeah um, absolutely love that feature of it now this does come with a little bit of a riser um, I kind of like that. I found with my uh, shotgun mic, when I had the dead cat on there, it kind of wanted to fall down a little bit into the frame. So with this little bitty riser, it was all it needed to get that up out of the way. So uh, I'm really glad that they uh, incorporated that into their design. Didn't make me have to order, you know, an extra part or something, you know, different to make this work. So real happy with that. These guys really did a good job there. And then there's this. The whole reason for this case is this little dongle right here. So with that, simply take and feed it down through here. Now the first time getting it in here, it's... There we go. All right. So you get this in there the way you want it. Okay. Now, I did find that slides in super super snug that thing is not going to fall out of there so when this is all in place this is one tough little cookie now i found if you take your cord and it's pretty stiff right out of the box but if you just take and give it a little bend and you plug it in in that fashion right there that seems to be about the best position keeps it nice and tucked away but there you go with the gopro hero 7 black in the uh, in the Ulanzi case gives you your port for charging and for data collection if you uh, want to just bring your camera into your uh, you know if you're using a laptop or you know a home computer whatever you're using to upload your videos makes it real easy you don't have to try to get the camera back out to get to your memory card just plug in directly to here upload your videos hey awesome little package so um, yeah there's that um, put that together with uh, with this here little mount there you've got a viewfinder in the front if you're vlogging um, or you just want to see what you're uh, you know taking a picture of um, from that angle it makes it really nice you do have a nice open view to the back of the camera so if you're shooting from you know in front of you that angle you do have good open area for this everything's nice and accessible so hey if you haven't already uh, got yourself one of these go ahead and check them out um, you can find this here on Amazon is where I got mine um, I bought it, so uh, I'm not being paid by them to put this video out. Hey, I hope you liked what we just did today. Um, like I said, you know, hit that subscribe button, ring that bell, ding, 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 ding. Get those notifications every single time I launch a new video. Thanks for sticking around with me. Thanks for putting up with me. And, uh, hey, get yourself some Backwood merch, you know, help support the channel, and uh, we love you. Hey, 
Do yourselves a favor. Be good to one another. Peace.